dear students i uh, hope you are all doing well welcome back again into my another lecture okay today we will discuss range cutter method uh, the most important question seven marks question as far as mathematics is concerned it is for it is common to all branches okay so anybody can refer this either csc stream student mechanical civil whatever okay so let us solve this particular question it is totally uh, purely formula based as the formulas are readily available uh, in your handbook okay which will be handed uh, to you people in the examinations okay let us solve this particular question we have the uh, formula for this range kata method that is uh, y of x naught plus h which is equal to y naught plus 1 by 6 k1 plus 2k2 plus 2k3 plus k4 this much is the formula for range kata method only thing is we need to determine these terms uh, like k1 k2 k3 and k4 okay what is given in the particular question it is the function of x y see here i can write function of x comma y which is equal to how much 3x plus y by 2 why i am telling uh, this is the function of x y c here in this equation x is present with a constant and y is present with a constant so this is the function of x y that is why i am writing it as f of x comma y okay hope you are getting and what is given the boundary condition this is the boundary condition y of 0 is equal to 1 it is uh, in general y of x naught is equal to y naught okay in general it is y of x naught is equal to y naught so instead of x naught what is given in the problem zero so i can write down x naught is equal to zero okay this is one so it, here in the general condition it is y naught so y naught is equal to one it is given in the problem right now compute y of 0 0.2 we will see it later on and by taking a step size h is called the step size which is equal to 0 0.2 so also i can write down h is equal to 0 0.2 now let us calculate one by one these particular terms that is k1 k2 k3 k4 once we will get these values then we have to submit those values in this particular equation so that we can get the required answer for the particular question okay so write down k1 is equal to it is given by h of x of sorry f of x naught comma y naught okay so i can write down h is given 0 0.2 okay this time we have function of x naught y naught but in the question f of x comma y is given so i can take down instead of this x and y i can take x naught y naught okay so 0 0.2 multiplied by what is the function 3x plus y by 2 so instead of x you have to take x naught instead of y you have to take y naught so so what is the x naught value 0 so 3 multiplied by 0 i can write down 3 multiplied by 0 plus y instead of y i have to take y naught so y naught value is 1 so 1 by 2 i hope you are getting my point so which is equal to 0 0.2 3 into 0 is 0 this is plus 1 by 2 1 by 2 means 0 0.5 0 0.5 into 0 0.2 is nothing but 0 0.1 okay so you can calculate this much this is the addition part very simple anybody can do this calculation if i will show you in the calculator it will take a lot of time i don't want to make this video too long okay so you have to go through the calculation part by yourself so now k2 k2 is given by h of f of x naught plus h by 2 comma y naught plus k1 by 2 this is your formula for k2 so h is given 0 0.2 f of x naught is how much 0 plus h is step size that is 0 0.2 divided by 2 comma y naught y naught is 1 plus k1 value we have already got here 0 0.1 so 0 0.1 upon 2 so i can write down here 0 0.2 f of so 0 0.2 divided by 2 it is how much 0 0.1 you will get right next is 1 plus 0 0.1 by 2 you will get 1.05 so i hope you will do the calculation part i am write, writing simply the values so now 0 0.2 f of 0 0.1 1.05 means x value you have to take in this equation that is 0 0.1 y value you have to take 1.0 Zero 05 hope you are following now i can write down 3 multiplied by x is here right x value is 0 0.1 plus y value is 1.05 so 1.05 divided by 2 okay so you will get k2 is equal to by multiplying and adi adding this one you will get k2 value as 0 0.165 so you can also cross check the answers and let me know in the comment section maybe uh, my answers may be wrong 
just because I'm not calculating here I'm simply taking the answers okay so you have to do the calculation and let me know in the comment section if there is any correction okay so that this can also uh, take down those particular values okay now k3 is equal to for k3 we have h of f of x naught plus h by 2 will remain same comma y naught plus here we were having k1 here we have to take k2 by 2 okay it is like that one see here how the formula is uh, expanding x naught y naught x naught plus h by 2 y naught plus k1 by 2 x naught plus h by 2 plus y naught plus k2 by 2 okay so which is equal to h is 0 0.2 f of x naught is how much 0 so 0 plus uh, h by 2 h by 2 means 0 0.2 by 2 comma y naught is how much 1 see here okay plus k2 we are getting here so 0 0.165 divided by 2 okay so you will get 0 0.2 f of this is 0 0.2 divided by 2 you will get 0 0.1 comma uh, this 1 plus 0 0.165 by 2 you will get 1.0825 then accordingly we will get k3 is equal to 0 0.2 f of 0 0.1 now you have to take down x value 0 0.1 in this particular equation so 3 multiplied by 0 0.1 plus y value is here 1.1.0825 divided by 2 so you will get the k3 value is equal to approximately approximately will get 0 0.16825 this is your k3 value okay now last term that is k4 we have the formula h of f of x naught plus h comma y naught plus k3 this is formula for k4 so write down h is equal to 0 0.2 f of x naught is 0 plus h is 0 0.2 comma y naught y naught is 1 plus k3 value is this much 0 0.16825 by calculating uh, this much you will get the value see here this is 0 uh, plus 0 0.2 you will get 0 0.2 f of 0 0.2 comma 1 plus this much 1.16825 now you have to take down x value in this particular equation and y value this uh, 1.16825 in this uh, instead of this y okay so you will get value k4 so i can write out here k4 is equal to by taking the full value now 0 0.236825 this is your k4 value i hope you will do this uh, small calculation over here okay now i have to put down these all values in this particular equation see here <coughs> so i can write down again the equation here that is y of x naught plus h is equal to y naught plus 1 upon 6 k1 plus 2k2 plus 2k3 plus k4 this is formula for range cutter method see here now i have to calculate at y of 0 0.2 it is given in the problem compute y at 0 0.2 so instead of x naught plus h i have to take y of 0 0.2 i have to calculate so y naught value y naught is 1 plus 1 by 6 k1 how much is k1 we have calculated this is 0 0.1 plus 2 into k2 how much is the k2 value 0 0.165 0 0.165 okay plus 2 times k3 k3 is how much 0 0.16825 plus k4 k4 is this much 0 0.236825 okay so once you calculate y of 0 0.2 you will get the required answer okay so as I earlier told you calculation part is a universe so I will take directly the answer over here y of 0 0.2 is equal to 1.1672208 which is approximately equal to 1.1672 I can take down okay so y of 0 0.2 is equal to 1.1672 is your required answer for this range kata method I hope you will do the varieties of problems on range kata method as it is the passing module I have included this module as passing 
passing module in your passing package okay if you are not uh, watched yet the passing packages of all the mathematics series what are the branch you may be having so you can go through accordingly i have uploaded all the videos for all the branches okay so go through those videos and uh, check the passing package and also do the numericals uh, which are very simpler ones in the model fifth and go through three to four problems from each concept okay so i wish you all the best for your examinations my dear friends and uh, share this video to all your friends who actually need it thank you Thank you.